Hi guys, it's Naked Chef here. So today I will I will prepare soup. Uh, it's good for this uh, colder weather, and it's also very easy, very simple. It's cause it's like a low budget soup, so you can use it what you have in the fridge. You know, I prepare uh, stock from the bones. I had a pork bone, so I have prepared the stock. You can take the meat off. There will be some uh, grated carrots, cooked carrots, and some onion, some vegetable, and then I will finish with some homemade grated pasta. So that's the stock. So I have the meat here. And you can use any kind of meat, you know, like for the stock, you know, you can do it beef, chicken, pork, or vegetable. So it's everything up to you, any kind of bones you have left over, you know. So I start with the pot, with the oil, and freshly grated raw carrot. Carrot, it will give you the sweetness and the natural color when you grate it before. So it looks golden, you know? it looks nice color. And that's the pasta on the end, what I will do, it's just it's just egg, salt and flour and then it's, it was sticking in the fridge and you have to just grate it and cook it inside. And also you have a veg from the stock, so I have only now carrots, but you can use any different vegetable what you have at home. Broccoli, parsnip, turnip, collard, you know, cauliflower, you know, you can use any kind of that. But right now I have only the carrots and onion, so I will use these ones. So I have here also leftover, you know, saute onion, pepper, so you can put it inside, it will give a nice taste and color also. We will continue cooking this, sweating, then you add on the stock, you don't have to use the old stock, you can use, you can keep the stock in the fridge and then you can use it for different cooking, you know, for different dishes, for different recipes. So now I add on the stock and I will cook a little bit because the carrots were raw, so I will now cook it and season. Seasoning with the salt, pepper and uh, you can use some herbs to finish things, you know, and everything. So the soup is almost ready, so I will put now the vegetable in. And the meat. You can use the meat for the soup or you can make, you know, like a spread for your bread, for your sandwiches or you can do wraps or anything, you know, mix it with yogurt, mix it with mayonnaise, with grated cheese, you know, there are many different kinds of things what you can do with the meat from the bones. And now bring the soup to the boil and then you will add on the grated you know, not cheese, but pasta, but I made fresh at home. So now the soup is boiling, so I can put So it will basically thicken up the soup and it will make it more tastier, tastier. The soup is ready. As you can see, it. nice flavor from the carrots. And this is delicious bowl of soup with meat, vegetable, and homemade pasta. Enjoy, guys.